We're down in Columbus at RCDRV looking at a 2010 carriage carry light fifth wheel. I believe this fifth wheel is about 38 feet long and we're touring through. And they're in the process of winterizing so they've got a generator hooked up outside right now. We'll go inside first and look around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got a cut out for the trash. Induction cooktop here. Yeah, I saw that two burners. Got the big uh, four door gas electric refrigerator. You get this huge space down here for storage. Right. The big deep drawer. Okay. I don't know if oh, it's a shark carousel convection, convection microwave. microwave. Yeah. Double door freezer, double door refrigerator, nice big. I believe it's either a 10 or maybe a 12 cubic foot. It's a model 1210. Yeah, 12 cubic foot refrigerator. Model, model 1210. Model 1210 nor cold. Okay. Almost need a step stool to get to something. <laughs> oh, this drops down. Well, nothing's gonna slide out. It's, it's my hands with deep. Okay. Two nice drawers down below it. Storage yeah. underneath uh -huh. the refrigerator. You've got some little drawers there. Are those soft clothes? No. Yeah, okay. they're not. But they do. Are, they are on they are, bearing sliders. They are real wood. Right. Tray nice, in there. Nice sinks. Yeah, nice big sinks. No cabinets overhead to get in your way. No, but this one could be like a little awkward to get to. Switches, outlet. There's an outlet in here for like a coffee maker or something. Got a DVD. This is your, your Sony. Mm-hmm. Nice. The TV's nice size. Little speakers underneath. Fireplace on. Yeah. Is it putting out heat or is it just... I think it's just on decor right okay. now. Okay. Probably because the electric's on. No, no. Does it swing? I can't. It's okay. There might be a way. I don't know. Cupboards above the TV. Right there. Dimmer switches. Yeah, dimmer switch. Well, this, I'm not sure what it is. Here's that. Hmm. Leather recliners. Um, I'm not sure. Pleather recliners. Yeah, I'm not sure. Pleather. It's got a look. Little table. table. Right. And if you look, look, ar look around the window, there's a sill, wooden sill oh. there at the window. I mean it's framed around the window frames nice with the wood. It is. Even though it's got the fabric coming down. These, this How about overhead? Are, I can't hardly reach it. 
but you just put stuff up there that you would right. access. It's, but it's all one. Or if you put it in I don't think there's any dividers like between here no, and there. No, it's all the way through. Okay. These windows crank out. There's four little windows. Yeah. We'll look at look at the windows on the don't outside. Look like they've been used much at all. Yeah, this has some wear on it, but uh, yeah, this is. Now it's got your Roman shades, like we. They is that what they call those? I think they're called Roman shades. Yeah, because here's your nighttime. Yeah, but if they're in good shape, yeah, they can, are. You can deal with it. I mean the carpet's dirt a little dirty showing somewhere it's but like I'm sure they'll there. they'll give it a they'll clean it. Yeah, there is two two yeah. speakers. So you can sit here and watch TV. But you could that could probably go over here and you move those there also. Mm. Yeah you might. You could swap a lot of a lot of fifth wheels, you could swap the couches and the uh What's recliners. Coax cable books. Oh, it's 2010. Mm hmm. also pass through but you can't open these two doors at the same time. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Alright, that that I think is just up a little higher, so I knocked my knees when I sat down, but I didn't knock it here when I sat down. But if you s yeah. But okay, see like this Mm-hmm. This comes out. Right, and shortens up. Right. That'd be for two people, one on each side. The question is, is does the table move or is it screwed down? Screwed you know down. What it looks like it should, but no, it does not. Okay. But in these it's comfortable to sit. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But yeah, I like the framing around the windows. That one doesn't open. Hmm? The, that window doesn't open. No. The two, uh, right, the two side ones don't. Whoa. The, right, the two side ones don't. It's uh, frameless. That's about all you get. And that window over there by the sink opens, so you should still be able to get it across. Mm hmm. Now, to me, this looks like it should go this way, but it's because the table can go out yeah. this way. Yeah. So. I think we can pop those off and unscrew the table. Mm hmm. We got switches. Ooh, here's a plaque. Are these chair plaques? There's a carriage plaque with signatures. Oh, yeah. Okay, here's your monitoring. Go to the door. And here's a remote control. Fantastic, man. Looks like a remote control for the furnaces. Yes. Check those. Here's your pantry. A couple slide out doors. Okay. And they push in place, so they should right. be Right. Okay. And the other one. 
A little cupboard. I can't see, so. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Looks like a wardrobe. Yeah. And small, there's a light in there. Right. Okay. Shut the door so we can open this. And there's a stump down there for you. In case the a technician needs help. Oh, you can shut the door in. Right. Okay. And that's nice that it has a window. Window valance. Yeah. Little light on the steps. Mm hmm. Oh, here's your breaker box. Okay. Has, must have a generator? Yeah. Um, it, yeah, it may. They're just not using it today. Is that your start? Okay, right. Good size one. That is some Okay, small sink, but this is just a toilet room sink. Okay, so yeah, it's a good size. Medicine cabinet there, okay. and then you have down down here is a tiny bit of storage. But you mm -hmm. toilet paper here. Oh, check it out! This toilet paper holder has a flap over. And I've top. seen that on a few <laughs> other brand, a few other models. I wonder if that keeps it from rolling off. You do have cupboards above the toilet there. Yes. Well, I told you that's where the um, your breaker box, yes. and then just a tiny bit, a few little shelves okay. there. And you got a, a fan. Right. And the vents. Thermostats here. Some controls. Uh, there we go. Get some lights on. Actually, it's not bad. That doesn't look like a fantastic fan, even though it has controls here for it. Oh, it's in the... It's, you know why? The bedroom has a fan. Uh, yeah, the toilet. Here, see? This way it's nice. Hold on. Because they got this cut out over here, your knees don't knock the cover. Even, see, like even. Alright, if you have it shut, it would work. Okay. But it does give you more room if the door's open. Yeah, okay. But, uh, see, they got this cut out over here. Right. So your knee does not knock. Yeah. Toilet paper is in a perfect place. Okay. I mean, oh. this is tiny, but you could wash your hands. It's, it. Yeah. Right. Or, gonna, you got a towel here. or I could you shave here. with it. Okay. Okay. Three drawers and a nightstand. Yeah, and they're fairly deep. There's washer and dryer lines. That was a pain in the butt. <laughs> Is there a washer and dryer in this one? No, there's a hookup. You can oh, the hookups there, are there. Though, yeah. Okay. Just standard mattress. Yeah. I like that. I mean, look at that nice wooden framework around there. Mm hmm. And you got and a window. Looks like you a got, a, but you can, you got your emergency hatch, but you got a crank mm. out for a draft through here. Yeah, yeah. Plus, you got the vent. And then you got your dresser and stuff over here. Yeah, and this is a queen size bed, so. Mm hmm. Let's see if it lifts up. There's the two folding chairs she was talking about. Yep. And the Oh, there's another bench cover. Yep, okay. Table cover. Oh. All right. It's weird that there's not another table. So. Is it anything? Oh, TV. Televator. Televator in the bedroom. Yeah. Okay. And those TV. that and the door just pops on. They got that off, so you see the TV. I bet because that door just la pops oh, on. Yeah, I it see. doesn't open. I wonder why it was off. Okay. Check out the door drawers. So. This is just a shelf. Okay. That's deep. But you also got all that overhead too. Yeah. Well, these I think are hanging. Now, no. These have shelves. Yep. Okay. Yeah, and you have these. But yeah, you could you could stack stuff up there. Right. If you needed to. And this is a padded ceiling. 
Yeah, he said it was soft vinyl, which right. would give you sound insulation. Right. Okay. Now, for the back bathroom, which is a shower. Oh, there's the, that's the one I said had, it was kind of odd that it had a mirror there. But I guess if you get dressed, you can stand over here and look at yourself. Mm -hmm. Okay, this back bathroom has a shower, a sink, closet for a washer dryer. Oh, but it also has a closet. There's a closet. Yeah, right, okay. and a main closet. I keep tripping on this mattress. Now, the closet has, it's not a bar, it's got loops you know what's nice about for the, the hangers. Bed? There's room there that you can get a higher bed. A thicker mattress. mattress. Yeah. And then you got this closet, which is set up for, looks like a washer dryer combo. Well, I don't even see. No, that's got hanger things. There's no He wa said there was water lines. You think it's in the back of this one? I don't see it. He was back here there is a piece it. of carpet, though. There is a piece of carpet. Ah, check this. Piece of carpet oh, on the floor. Oh, these were rods that they used, I bet they just left them here. Look. In here, too. Ah. I don't see no lines for a washer dryer, though that cupboard is made for it. I don't see no hookups. Well, he was just in here dealing well, with them. Ah, no. Check this out. Ah, there they are. There's the water lines and that you would have to put holes over to get to if you put a washer dryer in there, which the height of that, the way it curves, you probably would have to do a combo, not a stackable. Okay. Yeah, the plug's back there too. Okay. How about the cupboard above and the... Okay. Medicine cabinet. That's nice size. Medicine cabinets. So. Yeah, and this one. It'd be mm. nice to have like a puck under there. So this is the 2010 carriage carry light. I wonder if this is a safe. Top of the line, full time unit. It's a model oh, 30 37 MSTR. It's a, supposed to be about 38 feet long. Hey, come open this door. The and it has a built-in safe in the yeah, right under the carpet. So we gave it away. If you want to? Yeah, I was going to if I can get out of here. Try the shower. The light's not automatic. You, can um, automatic. you don't want to step in there. I don't think it's got pink stuff. And then you'll track it out. Just open oh, the sliding automatic. door. You don't want to step oh, in there. Yeah, I know. Pink. I know. Okay. It doesn't have a seat, though. I wish it had a seat. Yeah, okay. It does have a shade. There's your access back. hole to get to the plumbing. Oh. So. All right. It's got a what? It's got a shade from yeah. the skylight. And a light in the shower, too. Right. Okay. I think the fans in the two bathrooms I definitely would want to upgrade. Oh, yeah. The bedroom's got a fantastic fan, no air conditioner back here. That means it's only got one air conditioner, probably. Mm. We'll see when we go outside and walk. Let's... So, so what's your opinion? It's not bad. About 38 feet. Mm -hmm. I'd have to look it up, but that's what they sh that's what they showed on their website. Okay, this is a fold out bed. Fold out bed. Like I said, I think I think you could move the couch over here if you wanted, and put the recliners there if you wanted. Yeah, you might be so overall, it's a nice shape. Seems like a nice shape. The wood's not all marked up. I mean, there's a few here and there, but nothing out of the ordinary. Definitely solid wood, solid built. Yeah. Okay. And it's got the um, Corian countertop. Oh, is that what that's about? Yeah, that says Corian. Okay. And it's got a nice sturdy. Okay. There goes the electric here. for all the lights. The sinks are nice and deep. They're getting. Yeah, you got a water 
uh, paper towel holder here. Okay. I mean, I think it'd be workable. Okay. It must be moving on to another one, or about to untatch. I mean, you know, this is... <coughs> this would be like your coat closet. But yeah, but you could... You could put, like, larger pot appliances or something. Or buy there. some type of shelving and put it in there for yeah. for a pantry. Well, you got this pantry here. If you need more. This is nice, because this is easy to get to. Mm-hmm. There's quite a bit of cupboard. Because it's on a stool. And there's quite a bit of cupboard because, space. Because it's a step so I can reach all the way to the back. Right. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. There's quite a bit of cupboard space here, if you look. Yeah, surprisingly. It, for, in the yeah. kitchen. Okay. I mean, small bladed fan. Yeah. Yeah, there's your carrier. It's the a Air V heat pump. And I'm wondering if the remote control will it's work. This. It's this. Right. The air conditioner, but it might work the fan too. I don't know, or maybe not. That would be something if you're interested. There's a Dirt Devil outlet, so it's got built in. Mm. Built in. Here's back. a little kick sweep yep. thing. It's got a nice wide door, much wider than our Cougar, yeah. but no window in the door. Yeah, it's just got people. Yeah. Model number 37 MSTR. So. This actually looks like a bit of a plate. Uh, this one is nicer than the regular phone. Yeah. It's more grippier. We have a large awning. Do you want to open these hatch doors? If you can. Once. Okay, so the inside carpet needs some replacement. Needs some work. And this here, see, like this is coming apart. Yeah. So the, underneath here. Oh yeah, here's your. There's sweeper. definitely some work. I bet this is your sweeper hose. It is. Yeah, because there's the rest of it. Right. Okay, so there there's is. There's outlet, lights, cable. Mm -hmm. It looks nice though. I mean, look at how insulated. Yeah. It well, is. that's your heat duct. Yeah. So, definitely a little rough under here. But it's got struts that yeah, stay right. Yeah, the, well, those are replaceable. Okay. We've got an outlet here. I'm assuming that's tanks, LP. Oh, yeah, it's got the big ones. Oh, 240s, and they're on a tray. It'll, it pulls out a little bit, so good. Push it back. 240 gallons, so that's 80 gallons of LP. You got four steps to get up into it. You got an awning on the slide out up here. What? Oh, there's one here and one there too. Yeah, two awnings. Do they have awnings hoppers? No. Yes, it. These tires, the tread is a little, is down a little, it is worn down, so they'd have to be replaced. Now, this. This only has four point leveling jacks. Two front uh, and two back here. That's a pain. That's, that's nice. That'd be where you could put a spare tire. Because there's a door in the back, too. Yeah. <laughs> Just took a back seat full of boxes to Daddy's work. Lots of laughs. Had to coax Echo outside, but I brought Cleo, so they are out there right now. Oh, yeah, so you can access it through the middle. Right. And your crank's in there.
nice big windows back here. You know? There is uh, two air conditioners, dear. Yep, there's one back here in the living room. Oh, you know, I saw a smaller panel. Yeah. Maybe I was looking in the living room. There's one in the living room and one in the kitchen. And then there's the vent over top of the bedroom. Definitely a rubber roof. You know what's interesting is there's a like a two inch drip edge where the slide goes in on top of the slide here. Yeah. All the way down, longer a little bit longer than the slide. Yeah. I'll have to show you in the video. The, um, paint job is a see it up there a little piece of aluminum now, I don't oh. know if the person that bought it owned it yeah. and put that on there but it goes the full length oh. kind of like a edge now I did see that the foam up top oh, here up. Up. okay the foam up top here is coming loose on the slide up bubble oh. so that would have to be replaced yeah it needs a, a good wax job or something because um, you should go underneath and see what it looks like underneath there. Hey, it really is not too bad, hon. Wow, these are different. What? These brown. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I've never seen one like that. Well, they've got the ram bars on the track, and then these are just for support. And What's help. this up here? What do you mean? Like it looks like something's dripping down. Uh, it's just wire. No, again, again oh. it's not. It's a piece of rubber. Nothing big. All right, let me take a peek. There's the spare tire. Mounted up under here. There's a mounting jack. Yeah, yeah. Well, they just got done winterizing it, so. Mm -hmm. The caulking on it doesn't look too bad. Yeah, right. You know, no, it's it needs wa a good washing, but if you bought it, they pr they would should wash it before you take it. You know, they're not going to wash it ahead of time. Right. So, and these side windows tip out. That's the kitchen window, the hot water tank, the medic. Lug nuts. These are kind of interesting lights on the side. There's the refrigerator, refrigerator vent, and the, and the oven vent. Say what? It's scrunched up in there. Uh, it, it'll be fine. This is supposed to flip up in there. It's not going to hurt when the slide goes in. This is what they call a, there's your sewer hose. Sewer hose, furnace. Yeah, see here's the... So this is what they call su a super slide. Because this whole, this is a, a big slide on the one side. So they called these super slides because it's got your bedroom and your kitchen. Somebody didn't watch these things. And everything. Yeah. You know? They're full. What do, they're, what do they need? Because they're not coming out very well. They probably just need a little lubricant. Oh, this is your Schwinn cat, huh? Is that what you gear stuff? No. Oh. No. The Schwinn tech track is on the sides, not the bottom. Uh, this is actually the better system for slides. Uh, 
oh. for big slides. They don't use it on little slides. It's a little dirty under here. <laughs> they don't use it on little slides, just oh, big the slides. Here's the other side. See, here's low point drain. You gotta reach in there, I guess. No, you're not gonna have electric because they oh, did the thing. Funny. Here's the hose they used to suck water pump. This is in there, your water. Come back here. That's access behind the water thing. Here's your water bay. Okay. Because they got. This is the handles? For what? Push, push button. Push electric. Oh. Electric. You push the button and then it goes, zzz, there's a little motor and opens a tank mm. valve. You push the, uh, you push it again, it'll shut it. Your sprayer. It almost seems to me like it's been sitting for a while. Yeah, I don't know. Because you got all this build up in here. Mm. People bring them in, they don't always clean them when they turn them and trade them in. Yeah. So, and the, the, and the dealer may not clean them up really good until they sell it. Circuit, circuit boards, oh, extra parts. What? Here's your uh, battery cut off. Okay, and it's got the big foot level. <sighs> Fuses. No, the big foot leveling shouldn't have been taken out because that's what controls the leveling jacks. Where, where is it? I don't know. That's weird. Are we missing it somewhere? I don't see it. Oh, wait. Ah, there. Where's it go? It's disconnected. <laughs> All right, so it's disconnected right now. And that's batteries. Two, two marine batteries. Oh, this one goes down. Push it down. Up. You pull up. Yeah, marine batteries. Yeah. Trying to see if there's six volt or twelve. I can't tell. So that's your battery compartment. Ow. Watch your head. You might have gotten grease on your hair. Ow. You know, from the there's grease on those gears. Did they get grease on my head? No. Okay, it has the it has the more ride pin box rubber pin box here. Franklin County, Virginia. This was in Virginia. Okay. Let's check in here because oh. it we had a generator start thing you may have put this up first there's a latch you got that door yeah no generator so it's got the generator prep, generator prep. no generator Dude, it's huge in there yeah Okay, here's the hydraulic pumps for the legs for the Bigfoot system. And telepower converter. But, okay. So these you go like that. Yeah. There you go. But yeah, you can see like here the rubber seal didn't all come out when they put the slide out. You know. So, but yeah, I was doing it underneath. Yeah, I know. So they probably need moisturized. They're probably so, too hard and stiff. Okay, decal is kind of coming off on the front. Yeah. But so. Sealant seemed pretty good. Yeah, okay. That's been maintained. Yeah. So. No more look or what? Okay. So, okay, here's, here's the vent. Right. And there's a vent. Right. Yeah, that's your two air conditioners are in the front. Yeah, yeah. I mean, if you use these cupboards, you'd have to just like have a stool available to stand on because these are deep. 
Mm, that yeah, you'd figure it out. You're not gonna find you're not gonna find a rig that every configuration of cupboards is gonna be convenient for you. I don't believe that well. You know. Yeah. And if that doesn't swing out, I'm sure you could change it. We're almost no. These are wires. Okay. You know. You may not need it to swing out either. Well, if, yeah, I don't know if you're sitting over here. But if you put the couch there. You're going to do pull it out and turn it? Yeah, I'm going to try it. And then you got to put it back. If they don't rock. they got a lever on the side. But you're going to hit that because you're not far enough away, probably. It's plasticky. Yeah. But, I mean, it's a 2010, so it's gotten 10 years of use. Either that or they put, replaced it. Yeah, it could be. I don't know. Like these, these could be. See, see, mm -hmm. look. And then you got that. Mm -hmm. Okay. No, you, I gotta put. <laughs> Let's just do it this way. So someone can try it out that way. Yeah. So if the slide's going to go in, it's probably going to be turned. There's a register back here for heat vent. Watch that around the window. You know that? Yeah. The heat vent's back by the back window. Back windows. Watch the window frame. Let's see, try the couch and see what you think about the couch. A lot, you know what I mean? It's a not solid, too bad. Mm -hmm. No, it's a solid seat. Mm -hmm. sit and then in. you can try the couch and see what you see. Or the t chairs on the kitchen. You know, it's not that it's a. You know, compared to sitting in these, these just sink in. Mm -hmm. so, but they are comfortable. Should we put the piece back in? We could, because it, uh, it was there when we got here. You might have to go underneath and push it up. Yeah, that's... I do like the color of the wood. And this table, you know, mm -hmm. cabinet. It's almost, I don't know if it's like a maple or a cherry. Yeah, I don't Try the little bench over there and see what you think. Yeah. But I can see how that could double as a end table. Well, it's <laughs> I think it's a coffee table because of the thing at the bottom. If it was just a bench, you wouldn't have that at the bottom. You might have brackets, but it sets higher than those do. It does. Because so. I knocked my knee on it when I so sat I, in there. Technically, I think it is the coffee table. Because it's got the same kind of footing and stuff as the little end table over right. there. Yeah. Yeah, so. But a coffee table, I could kind of see where it would get in the way. Depending. You know. Yeah, but this is wide open. You don't have an island here. So, it might, but it might not. Mm-hmm. So, okay. I mean, there's a few things. I mean, it, it would be a doable unit, but there's a few things that it doesn't, you know, it doesn't have an oven. It has induction. Not a gas. Right. And... It doesn't have a huge trash care area because you're only going to get a little one in there. Yeah. You're not going to get a 13 gallon. Yeah. Trash can. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And um, though you know, who knows? You you might be able to stick them over there in the coat closet, a trash can yeah. too, or something too. Yeah, it, that's a possibility. 
you know you could yeah just stick one in, in there in the bottom for say paper and cans but not garbage but i mean as far as room for the kitchen it doesn't seem bad you've got no. a nice size pantry no and the refrigerator's a nice size right and um we like that you know that you could do this the toilet room is fairly spacious with a sink in it i thought it was roomy enough to compared to a uh, one without a sink It's got your double entry. Yeah, all right. My battery's getting down, so let's finish uh, this up. Right, right. Yeah. Did so you sit here? No. You sit on the I don't have to. If you fit, I fit. I mean, it does have a nightstand over here yeah, with, definitely. That would with work. an outlet. Yep. And three little drawers. Right. Now, it's not as big a nightstand as you have at home, but you know. That's big enough. Right. So you might have to put the clock over here honey you know over here plugged oh, in yeah, one yeah. of these sides and that would with the alarm the and that would be for the CPAP and glasses you don't you wouldn't have a plug your glasses for your phone. no my phone could sit over here it sits yeah. on a bookcase but at home like anyways set, you could set your glasses yeah. down there or something and no I'm surprised there's some moisture there but mm. th but this this area has room to put a thicker mattress oh yeah uh, b below the uh, window yeah definitely and there's, you know, room. And, I mean, as much storage space as the television takes, being down like that, mm -hmm. if you don't use it, you don't use it. It's not, you know, it's not like it's sticking up in the road like a lot of yeah. them stick it up here in the middle and it takes, that's taking up storage space, but right. it's there all the time for you to look at. This way you don't have to look at it. You can set stuff, you can put a doily on top of that and hide that if you never use mm, the TV. Yeah, yeah. And set set stuff on there. Take the TV out and use it for storage. Yeah, you could put different doors I mean, the shower, on it or the shower, something. shower, like it, it's okay. I, it's a corner. They're all I about the need, same size. Yeah, and maybe I could somehow find either something soft to put on the bottom for, for my foot or some kind of small seat or yeah a, uh, a small because bench. my dad told me he bought a thing at walmart yeah the, for steps the chair you got at home right now it will not fit in there. no it won't fit so view from the bedroom entrance so